What are your impressions of the artwork that you've seen tonight? Well, I'm not finished yet, but it's uh, that the kids have really put together the past and the present in such a wonderful way. And it's so exciting to see them take these old pictures and do something with them. It's, it's really neat. Jacob Jazik, this is my painting. And I focus on the fun of Whistler and coming up with train and how it brought people. I changed the color of it and added some abstract stuff to it to make it seem more fun and friendly. I like this project because we got to learn about Whistler through art. So I'm Jacqueline McKinnon and I did this piece and I just painted a couple of pictures. I just tried to showcase that all of the people have changed all throughout the history of Whistler, but the beauty of Whistler has not changed. It was fun to learn about like all the history of Whistler because I was born here so I didn't really know a lot about it. Because we did this in an art class, we have sort of got a collective group of people who are visually oriented, they're visual learners, they express themselves visually, they have an interest in the visual. So the fact that they were asked to answer this historical question visually, it, it would seem much more natural to some of them. And there's such a range in terms of um, media that they used, the, the images that they created, the, um, the skill level. Um, and some of, some of my favorite pieces aren't necessarily the best technically produced pieces. They just have an emotive quality to them that speaks. Um, I think initially when we um, when we talked about this project and when we introduced it to the kids, they were uh, sort of scared about putting their pieces on display. It was a big thing for them that they had to present it to their classmates and that it was going to be put on display in the museum and then potentially on the museum website. That was very... Um, it produced a lot of fear and anxiety in a lot of the kids. But then when we took it down and we just blocked it into tiny little bits that they had to do each day, and then they had to they, they had to produce the image, and then they had to do the artist statement, and just the way that we did that, we broke it down. It made it less scary for them, and they were able to produce, I think, some amazing pieces. And I think the kids are, in general, very proud of what they've done.